Trace his picture out. I've already taken a digital picture of him. Now I'm tracing it out on tracing paper. So let me get all that traced out. Yes or no? Yeah. Okay. Let me finish out these edges here because we're going to bring these down. I kind of look like Mac Raining, actually. You know, the uh, guy did The Simpsons. Right. Bring that there. Just your circle all the way around here. So. that look like? You think that looks pretty good? That looks great. You think? Yeah. Handsome guy. Okay. We got our basic drawing done. You see what I'm saying? Huh? Yeah. Off to Kinko's we go. We blow it up. We come back. 
we're going to make an artistic picture of the camera cut. Are you ready to go? I'm ready to go when you are. And let's go. All right, turn it on. All right. What we're going to do today is cameraman Ken's with us on a Sunday. He came all over. This is a special day. And what we're going to do, and I'm a little bit of artistic type guy myself. If you look over here, I took a picture of Ken in the office. All right. Then what I did is I traced him out. You've already seen that. Okay. Then I went over to Kinko's and I blew it up. All right. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually make a portrait of our pal Ken, the cameraman. Right, Ken? Yeah. Ken's kind of excited, right, buddy? I can't wait to see myself in that one. Okay. <laughs> and we're going to make us a self-portrait of Ken, the cameraman. So the first thing I need to do is I'm going to give you a brand new fresh seat. Sheet metal. And this is the table, cutting table I made. I set myself up in a little circle here so I don't have to go around and round and roundy. Okay, here's our plasma cutter. Let me set that up. And I looked at that tip and it still looks like it's still pretty good. Those tips are very expensive, by the way. So you use them as much as possible. They start to melt on you, though. You want to change them out. And we got our ground. There. And what I'm going to do is I'll be right back home. So I get that all cleaned up. I use lacquer thinner because lacquer thinner dries. If you look real good at that rag, you can see all the filth that just came off it. And all that's for is so I can uh, draw my pictures and all my pieces on it. This is going to be a three dimensional picture of our pal Kim. Are you excited, Kim? Can't wait. Ken's kind, of, Ken's kind of busy right now holding that camera way up in the air. So I got to get a measurement of what Ken, this Ken, the size of Ken is here. And I see 24 is pretty good. And we're going to make it a little bigger than that. We're going to go 27 by 25. This is going to be our backing plate. So we go 25 here. Maybe take the scrap iron yard and get some. Or if we're lucky, he, may, he might like it. Yeah, that's how I big fun. He might like it and hang it up. You wouldn't throw that in the trash after all this work. Yeah, absolutely not. Pete Hughes original. He like throwing away a baton. So we're going to make our. Uh, go ahead and make our frame first. I go ahead and set my heat range where I want it. Safety glasses all the time. My phone, my two phones, the camera go. Camera's fine, but we're good cameraman, Ken. Let's keep him professional. Ken's a little artistic. He likes to try to get these artistic. I keep telling him that it's just fucking instructional, but we're gonna let Ken film it any way he wants today, because this is all about Ken. I'm wearing this because when you cut this, Smoke comes up from the plasma cutter, and I really don't want to have to breathe that. Yeah. 